If you own real estate in Lafayette Parish, then this month's market update is just for you. I'm Jim Cady with Cady Real Estate. In this month's real estate market update, we're bringing you nothing but the facts. I'm going to share with you eight highlights about the housing market that are affecting your home's value. And I'm going to do it in 110 seconds or less. Now for the numbers. Lafayette Parish reported 359 homes sold last month. This is up 1.4% from the previous month, but it's down 20.8% compared to July of 2021. The total sales volume last month was $108.1 million, and that's up 0.4% over the prior month and down 11.3% year over year. 365 homes came onto the market in July, and that is down 24.1% from the previous month. There were 317 homes that went pending in July. This is down 15.1% from the previous month, but represented 87% of all the new listings in July. The average amount of time a house stayed on the market in Lafayette Parish was just 31 days, and that's the same for the last few months. The average sales price in July was 301,234. This is up 13.4% compared to July of last year. And the MLS reported 22% of the homes sold in July sold above list price. And that is down 6% compared to July of last year. This is double the average over the last decade. So why are buyers paying over list price when interest rates are rising and sales are slowing? It's still a seller's market and we will most likely continue to see sales above list price as at least until supply outpaces demand. All right, that was your update in less than 110 seconds. We pride ourselves on being the expert advisor. So if you're thinking about moving up, moving down or moving away, or maybe you just have a real estate question, let me help you put your real estate game plan together. And if you want to stay ahead of the competition in this ever-changing market, stay tuned for more videos just like this. Thank you so much for trusting me as your source of accurate local real estate information.